own and see if you can do two on your own. That's what I was trying to say. Miss Miss um, Saunders is getting prepared for you, her recording, because she has to record you guys. Um, this is her last recorded lesson that she'll be doing. <laughs> yes. All right. Yes. Okay. I'm, I'm um, ready when you are. All right, um, so you get ready, Miss Off. So they're, they're okay. um, all right. I see my friend got you and oh, Captain got you and yes. All right, Miss Miss um, Saunders. They were just writing their names. So if you want to pick up on that and get ready to do whatever you need to do, okay, that's fine with me. So if you did, um, we already did our morning song. All right, good morning, friends. Good morning. Can I um you unmute yourselves and say good morning to me, please? Morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How are we feeling today? Good. Okay, so we are writing our names. And I'm sure you already wrote how you feel. How you feeling? Let me see your smiley faces. Show me your face of how you're feeling along with your name. Good morning, Miss Barnes. Good morning, Miss Fan. And good morning, Miss Richardson. All right, good job, Kathleen. I see you have yours nice and written with your name and you wrote your sight words for today. Okay, Logan, good job. I love what I'm seeing. All right, Aubrey, good job. Damaris, good morning. I'm hoping you're having a good morning so far. Just take your time whenever you're writing. Okay. Good yeah. morning. Good morning. Good morning, uh, Amari. Are you there? Today is Monday, and today is going to be an awesome day. Write your name, Emmy. Write your name. I see Damaris is writing his. Come on, guys, hurry up. We got to move a little faster, okay? Because our time is running up. We only got, like, one more minute. <laughs> All right. So I'll give you one minute, and then we want to move on to the next portion of our lesson, okay? Good job, Aubrey. Emmy, let me see yours. Taylin. All right. Um, we're going to get started to our lesson. So that our I lesson. Did, I, did, I didn't write my first name. Okay. I'm giving you time. That we have one more minute to do it. And I didn't write my smiley face because I couldn't do it. Okay, Taylin. I'm giving you time, sweetie girl. If you can't write your smiley face, I'm sure you can try to just write something of how you feeling. You're so beautiful today. Oh, thank you, sweetie. I appreciate that. You're awesome. I like that nice hat you got on you. Thank you, sweetie girl. All right, Miss Saunders is going to give you a 10-second countdown. Whoever has not shown me that name and that smiley face in this countdown, you have to show me because I have to teach you all, okay? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Ding, 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 ding. Time is up and we are moving along. Good job, friends. Thank you for sharing out your feelings and your emotions. Today I'm feeling a little nervous, but it's okay because we're going to get this um, thing started. Can you all repeat after me? Can you unmute yourselves and repeat after me? Do you, are they able to unmute themselves? Okay, there we go. I have Logan. Okay, I just wanted you to. I just wanted you all to do the. Um, just to know what you're learning today. So uh, today we will tell. Can you repeat after me? Probably not. Okay, today we will tell more details from the story. Now, now the story that we're going to be doing, that we're going to be reading today or learning from today is called Everyday, Everyday Spring. Okay, everything is spring. So I want to know, does anybody know anything about baby animals? Because today we will be able to identify baby animals, animals I born in the spring. So, you know, do you know about anything about baby animals, Aubrey? Yeah, when we went to Auntie's house, we saw the baby deer. Okay, you saw a baby deer. 
All right, please, everybody who want to share out, I'm letting everybody who want to share out be able to raise your hand and I will call on you. Okay. Yes. Okay. Thank you, Aubrey. Yes, Braylon. I hear you talking. <laughs> Do you know about any baby animals in spring? Does anybody else want to share about baby animals in spring? I didn't ever see a baby animal. A baby animal in spring. So we're going to talk about baby animals in spring. I wanted to know, what do you know? Aubrey told me that she saw a baby there at her aunt's house. Does anybody else know anything about baby animals in spring? Austin, I see your hand is up. I saw a baby horse. A baby horse? Thanks for sharing. Um, and we're, we're going to talk about baby animals in spring. I don't think a baby horse is a baby animal in spring. But thank you for sharing out. I definitely appreciate that. Um, so... Does anybody else know anything about baby animals in spring, Logan? I also a baby monkey. A baby monkey? Okay. Yeah. So we want <laughs> I saw a baby monkey before too in the zoo. Um, but what I want to do is we want to discuss baby animals in spring. So that is what we want to focus on today. We're focusing on baby animals in spring. So I want to share a picture with you all. And I want you all to be able to tell me if you know this baby animal. Does anybody know this? A baby, duck. A, a baby duck. A baby duck. Good job. Thank you for sharing out. This is a baby duck. And so because you was able to identify that, I'm going to give you a clap. Good job. Good job. You are so intelligent. I'm so surprised. Um... And I know that we had some English language learners here, so I would like to say that in Spanish, a baby I duck is share. pato. Taylor, give me one moment. I'll give you a chance to shout, sweetie girl. Um, but the baby duckling name in Spanish is pato. So we're going to learn about the baby duck today. We're going to learn about the baby lamb. We're going to learn about a chick. We're going to learn about a fawn. And we're going to learn about a toad. Now, I know all of you may not understand what these different animals' names are, but as we go through our lesson, we are going to learn about those specific animals. Taylor, what did you want to share out, sweetie? Where are you? What did you want to share out, love? I want to share if I, I saw a baby duck and I find a baby duck. Okay, you saw a baby duck before? Okay, so big. So that's good. I'm glad you are able to tell me about a baby duck because that is a baby animal that is born in spring. So let's get into... I like the other ducks right here next fish. Yes, it is different ducks. Um, let's get into our lesson, all right? I want everybody... Can walk on grass, right? Can walk on grass, yes. Taylor, give me one moment. I want to share. I want to get our video started, okay, sweetie girl? And I love your enthusiasm to share out. I really appreciate that. At this point, I want everybody to pause. Pause one. Your cameras and mics, I mean, not your cameras, your mics should be muted because I want everybody to be able to hear this story. And we are going to learn about everything spring, but we are only looking for what? What are we looking for today in class? Unmute yourself, tell me. Animals. What kind of animals? Um, ducks. We're looking for baby animals, okay? We'll learn about baby animals in spring. Good job. Thank you, Logan. All right. Can y'all hear this sound? Can y'all hear this video? You can? I can hear it. Okay, good. Everything spring. You never know where a new friend might pop up. Spring tiptoes in, stirring up earthy smells, coaxing color from the winter brown woods. Okay, I'm going to pause right here. 
I remember that Aubrey told me that at her aunt's house, she saw a baby deer, right? And so I want to pause here and tell you something that I noticed. I noticed a baby deer right here on the screen. And the, ba the name of a baby deer is a fawn. Hello? Somebody unmuted? Ethan. Okay. So the name of the baby deer here that I noticed is a fawn. Who is talking? Okay. And new undergrowth. Barely visible. I want to also tell you what I noticed about this animal. What does this animal have on itself? I'm seeing. I see this animal have spots. Yes. My computer is about to die. I don't have the charger because we're at the trap. Okay, so that's fine. Just stay right there. Um, when you get a chance, you can charge your computer up, okay? Okay. Okay, sweetie. Thanks for letting me know because I was going to look for you. Okay. So this end was a baby fawn and it um has spots so let's see the... please pop mute your mics spots curled up legs tucked a newborn fawn watches spring nudges awake slumbering trees leaves unfurl to hide fluffy nestlings gobbling a buggy breakfast Spring pulls flowers and rubbery mushrooms from unexpected places. Abracadabra. Spring welcomes new arrivals. Deep in the meadow grass, velvety but. Okay, I'm going to pause here. Can anyone tell me what, do, what baby animals do they notice on the screen in this part of the story? Raise your hand. I want everybody to have a chance to share out. Okay, Austin, I see your hand is up. Tell me the baby animals that you notice. Ducks. Okay, so you notice the baby ducks. Okay, and can yeah. you tell me what do you notice about them? What are they doing? They are on way a big duck. Okay, they are following a big duck. And who do you think that big duck is? Somewhere. Who do you think that big duck could be a mommy or daddy? Mommy. Okay, so you think the baby ducklings are following behind their mommy? But what are they doing to follow behind their mommy? They following. They're following her. What are they inside of? What is this thing that they're pedaling through? Uh, they just. Um, they are split splashing. What are they splashing in? In the water. In the water. Thank you, Austin. That's a smart guy. The and the baby ducklings are following behind mommy, and they are all splashing in the water. Good job, Austin. That is amazing. All right. Can anybody else tell me something that they noticed about these animals, these baby animals on the screen? Let's go with, I'm going to call someone, um, Liam. Liam. Can you unmute yourself and tell me something that you notice about these baby animals? I'm a baby bunny. A baby bunny. Good job. This baby bunny. What do you notice about the bunnies? Oh, are they are they are they laying with each other? Yes, because they can jump so high. Okay, yeah, so they're laying with each other. I wonder why. I wonder if they're cold. If that's the reason why they're laying with each other. But yes, you are right. Baby bunnies can jump high. Good job, Liam. They're so cute. And they are so cute. I just want to squeeze them. Good job. I'm glad you was able to share out. Does anybody else want to share out before we move on to the next page? Braylon, go ahead, sweetie. Liam, thank you, Liam. I saw baby turtles. 
You saw Baby Turtle off on this page? No. Okay, I want to talk about the, the, the animals. Baby Turtle from In My World. Okay, thank, oh, so you're telling me about another baby animal that you know about. Okay, thank you, Braylon. I appreciate that. We're going to continue with this story, and I want us to think of baby animals in spring because, remember, that's what we are looking for, baby animals in spring. Bunnies huddle, noses twitch, twitch, twitching. Fuzzy ducklings totter to a rippled pond. Splish, splash. In they go. Webby feet. Piddle paddling. Spring brings babies to the barnyard. Peep, peep, peep. Hoppy yellow chicks explore beyond the nest. All right. Here are three different types of baby animals in spring. I wonder if anybody can tell me a name. Can anybody name one of the baby animals here on this page that are born in spring? Bailey, Bailey, could you tell me one of the baby animals that are here? I want to share two. Okay, who is that? I didn't see your hand. Taylor. Taylor, that's uh, Taylor. Taylor. Taylor, give me one moment. Let Bailey share out, then I'm going to allow you to share. Okay, Taylor? Mm -hmm. All right, awesome. Bailey, could you share out one of the baby animals you see on the screen? You, you have to, yep, you got to unmute yourself. Good morning, Bailey. A pig. Okay, you see a baby pig. Now, do you know what baby pigs are called? Pig, pig. Piggies or piglets. Piglets, like off of uh, Winnie the Pooh, right? Good job, Bailey. Thank you for sharing. I love that you have on your looking eyes and your looking, listening ears. All right, Taylor, do you, can you name any baby animal that's on this page, on this screen? That's my lip um, I see a chicken and a lamb. There we go. Good job. We see a baby chick. A baby chicken is called a baby chick and a baby lamb. Good job. Now, Taylor, can do you think you could tell me what sound you think a baby chick can make? <laughs> good job good job okay we're going to skip ahead and i have this certain animal i want you to all to see and then we're going to pause pause one thank you in a sheltered bend wiggly black tadpoles wait feeling froggier by the day spring urgent can anybody tell me what is this animal what is this baby animal? I'm listening, Amari. Go ahead, sweetie. You have to unmute yourself. Amir. Amir. I'm sorry. Amir. <laughs> monkey. Oh, Catherine said this is a monkey. Okay, Catherine. <laughs> Catherine, why do you think this is a monkey? <laughs> Maybe because it's jumping, but what I want to say, this is a frog. This animal here is a frog. And in the spring, before the baby frog turns to a big frog, the name of that animal is called a tadpole. And if we see right here, I'm going to draw on this page, and then we're going to get started with our, our little quick little baby activity. This right here is considered to be a tadpole. Can anybody unmute themselves and say tadpole? Tadpole. A tadpole. Good job. So, with that being said, we're going to pause this, the, the story right here. But what I am going to do, I am going to skip ahead to one of the this last page. Now, there are three different animals on this page, three different baby animals that are born in spring. I want you to get your whiteboards out, please. Pause one, whoever's talking. I'm trying to give instructions. Pause. Yeah, Madison, you have to mute yourself, baby girl. Thank you, sweetie. I want you all to get out your writing boards, okay? And this is what I want you to do. I'm going to tell you what to do, and then as we're sharing out, I might ask you more questions. 
I want everybody to draw one animal that they see. One baby animal born in spring that you see on this page. I want you to draw that. And I'm going to set a timer for about five minutes. I know we're almost done. We're almost done. You got, you got time, Miss Miss. Um, okay. So, I know we started a little they're late. Not done until nine forty. Okay. And they go on break. Okay. Let's let me get a timer on. Oh, you know what? Y'all need that screen. Okay. I'll do a timer on my phone, on my watch. Okay. We are going to look at this screen and we're going to draw one of the baby animals that we see. And I'm going to do it with you. Good morning, Miss Saunders. Good morning. How are you doing, Mr. Acosta? I'm good. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna let them know what you just said. Thank you. Thank you. Todos los estudiantes tienen que sacar sus pizarras y dibujar un animal que vean en el video que van a enseñar la maestra. Uno de esos animales se ven en las primaveras y ella quiere saber si pueden dibujarlo. Cualquier animal que ustedes vean en la primavera. And when you are finished drawing your uh, baby animal, I want you to hold it up or so that I'll know we're done. And then we can share out as a group. You all have about, you all have about three more minutes. Three more minutes, three more minutes, three more minutes. <laughs> Y'all, this, this little... Three more minutes, three more minutes, three All right, we have two more minutes and then we're going to share out. I'm Thank you, Logan. Let's let I'm going to give everybody a chance to share. Out. I'm going to call on everybody. Everybody is going to have a chance to share out, okay? Taylor, did you? Did you? Taylor, did you draw yours? Uni. Junie, sorry. Okay, all right, I see it. Good job. You are doing an awesome job. You stand up with the lesson. You know what we're talking about. It's amazing. I mean, it's Miss Saunders. Miss Saunders, yes, that's me. <laughs> all right. One more minute. And while we are sharing out, I'm going to take the screen down because I want to see everybody and have everybody give a chance to share out. Singing. Is that you, Taylor? Is that you, Taylor, singing? And pause one. 
Here we go. For those that are finished, hold up your um, hold up your whiteboard so that I can call on you. And those who are not finished, continue to draw your picture out. And then when you're ready, just hold it up. I'm not rushing anyone. We have enough time to share out. Okay, first person that's going to share out share out is Naslin. Naslin. Nasly. I'm sorry. Nasly. <laughs> Nasly. Mr. Costa. Los que han acabado de dibujar el señuelo en la pantalla para que la maestra le llame. Nasly, tú eres la primera que ella ha llamado. ¿Puedes enseñarnos? And can you ask Nasly to um, tell us what animal did she draw? Nasly, ¿qué, qué animal dibujaste? No te podemos escuchar. Tienes que quitar el silencio de tu micrófono. Cualquier animal. Does she know how to um, unmute or no? Yeah, I, I told her. Um, Nasly, ¿puedes quitar el silencio de tu micrófono para escucharte? No te podemos escuchar. There we go. ¿Qué animal, qué animal dibujaste, Nasty? Un chancho. A pig. Oh, yes. Good job. That is a piggy. A baby piglet. Good job, Nazlin. All right. Good job. All right. Next, I see who else is ready. Liam, are you ready? I want to see. How do I know if you're ready? What should you be holding up for me to see? What should you be holding up for me to see your baby animals born in spring? Okay, I see Logan is ready. Taylor was ready. All right, what about Kathleen? Catherine? Catherine. Oh, it was right the first time. Okay. I just don't want to mess their names up. Oh, nice. What did you draw? Did you look at it? Mr. Costa, can you ask her what baby animal did she draw? Pajarito. What did you Pajarito. She said a bird. Uh, okay. A baby, chick. a baby chick. Good job. Good job. One moment. I'm going to give everybody a chance to share out. Give me one moment. Okay. Can I go? Yes, go ahead, go. You can go. Go ahead. Yes, go ahead. She want to share out. Go ahead, baby girl. You gotta go to the bathroom. Oh, Ellen. oh Ellen wants to share. Yeah, she want to share out. Go ahead, Ellen. What did you draw, baby? Can you mind the Ellen? A cat. A cat. Yes. A baby kitten. Uh -huh. A baby kitten. Okay. <laughs> you still draw, but okay. Good job, sweetie. All right, let's go with Madison. Good morning, Madison. What baby animal did you draw? I draw a cow. You drew a baby cow? That's considered to be a calf, but okay, good job. You did a good job, Madison. Good job, good job. I love how you all are participating and you're drawing your pictures. All right, Logan, Logan, you've had your whiteboard up. I'm not ignoring you. Share out. I draw, I draw a baby duck. He's in the water. Okay, oh. so you draw a baby duck in the water. So, Logan, can you say I draw a baby duckling? Baby duckling. And can you tell me what sound does a baby duckling make? Quack, quack. Quack, 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 quack. Good job, Logan. That is amazing. All right, let's go with Bailey. Bailey has her, her board in her hand up. Piglet. Okay, so Bailey, you drew a piglet, and I was going to ask you to write the name, and you wrote the name, and you spelled it correctly. Can you tell me what sound does a baby piglet make, Bailey? Oink, oink. Oink, oink. Was you about to say quack, quack? <laughs> no. Yeah, so a baby piglet <laughs> makes the sound of oink, 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 oink. Good job. All right, I see Jeannie has his board up. Mr. Um, Mr. Um, Acosta, could you ask him to share out, please? Jeannie, ¿qué, ¿qué dibujo tienes? ¿Nos puedes enseñar? 
Yes, unmute his mic. Unmute your mic. Junior, tienes que quitar el silencio de tu micrófono para escucharte. A pato. Pato, you drew a baby duckling. Good job. All right. A cat and a duck. Oh, he drew a cat and a duck. He wanted to give me tea. He said, Miss Saunders, here's two animals and leave me alone. Good job, sweetie. Uh -huh. <laughs> Taylor, are you ready? Are you ready to shout, Taylor? Is that, is that um, El, did Ellen share? Amelia? Alejandra has something up. Yeah, she just got finished. They were they just put their um whiteboards up. Their boards up. Tayden is finished. Go ahead, Taylor. It's a baby quack quack. A baby can you say one more time, baby? It's a baby quack quack. A baby quack quack. What's the name? <laughs> Taylor. A baby duckling. Good job, Taylor. <laughs> <laughs> Good job, Ellen. Mute yourself. Good job, Taylor. That's a baby quack quack. All right, let's go with Alejandra. Ellen, por favor, ponle silencio tu micrófono. Can she hear you? Can she hear us? Ahora, Alejandra, te toca a ti. Alejandra. Okay. Alejandra, ¿nos puedes escuchar? ¿Qué dibujaste? Que 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 that's good. Good job, baby girl. Does anybody else want to share? We have about one minute for sharing out. I want to make sure everybody have a chance before we wrap up our lesson. Tayden, your um book is up. Tayden, you can share out. When I get over it, can I put a song on? Yes. Sure. We're going to do that. Tayden, would you like to share out, sweetie? Um, I was just telling you, Lily, really, get over it. Can we put on a song that's Old Town Road? Yes, I got Yes, it. we can put on Old Town Road. Okay, did everybody share out who wanted to share out? Before we get off topic, did everybody share out who wanted to share out? Now, can I have, I'm going to select two students to tell me what did we learn about today in class. I'm going to select two students to tell me what did we learn about today in class. So can I have... Um, Nazlin, Nazli, to tell me what did we learn about today in class, Mr. Acosta? Nazli, ¿qué es lo que aprendimos hoy en la clase? ¿Nos puedes decir? Hey, I got something else. I One moment, Taylor. Uh, Taylor, Taylor. One moment, Taylor. Taylor. You gotta stop interrupting, okay? Taylor, one moment. You gotta raise your hand. Nazli, ¿nos puedes decir qué es lo que aprendiste hoy? Did she understand what you saying to her, Mr. Acosta? Yeah, I'm not sure if she saw. Ten. Okay, that's fine. Let's have um, Bailey, and then I'll get Logan, and then we'll be done. Can you tell me what did we learn about today in class, Bailey? Baby animals. Good job. When are they born, though? Baby animals born in what season? Oh, my goodness. Bailey, you hit it right on the head. Good job, Bailey. All right, and Logan will be the last person to share, and we are done with our lesson today. Logan, what do we learn about today? Baby ducks. Baby ducks who are born in spring, baby animals born in spring. All right, you all, y'all did an awesome job. We were able to draw our pictures, share out our feelings, share out our ideas. And you are awesome. Thank you so much. I love you all.